All right, I'm gonna reassemble the SM Cyclo drive. This is the output section. Here we'll do this in stages, that way it's a little easier to deal with. Uh, this is the output housing. I've already pushed the seal in there. It is a number 14701, standard just lip oil seal. This is the output shaft itself. Uh, these bearings originally are double shielded. These have been, you see the inner shield here has been removed, the shield there has been removed, and the shield there has been removed. This one we leave in place to help retain the grease. Don't know how well it works, but it's what we do. If you're using new bearings, you should be okay with this. They, uh, the only trick is you have to make sure you get ones with metal bearing cages. Otherwise, the plastic will disintegrate and all the balls will fall to one side and you'll have trouble with it. This is the bearings. It's just a 6206 bearing. Very standard stuff. Um, really not much to this. Make sure a little bit of grease on the seal surface and a little bit of lubrication here. This just has to be dry and clean, you know, empty and clean. Uh, there is a gasket that goes in here, so this gasket surface has to be clean. And if there are any dings on the surface here, they'll need to be filed flat, otherwise it will not seal correctly. You can see where there's been some, you know, some high spots knocked off of this. But basically, this just goes together and it should pop out with the seal surface just a little bit proud of the seal itself. The, this is all retained with these little cone, these cone screws here. I don't know how well that shows up. Just put these in with a uh, little Permatex number two or whatever your favorite sealer is. Something that won't harden, disintegrate. And these just kind of go in tight. They push against the out outer bearing here and retain it. And other than that, there really isn't a whole lot to the output assembly that uh, isn't relatively obvious. I'll make another video for the input assembly and then for the middle section itself and we'll be good to go.